everyone and welcome back to another video so we've got another timu haul today um so yeah i've got one of these bags this time i've not had one of these for a while um so i'm just going to open it and we're just going to start so as you know timu is an online marketplace a bit like aliexpress or amazon or one of those places where you can get loads of different things um i get nail products from them but you can get kitchenware you can get stuff for your car you can get storage stuff um you know kids toys clothing everything like that so the prices are incredibly cheap um and the postage isn't that bad either because you get you get your goods within a week well i do from the uk anyway uh yeah and the quality of stuff is just as good as it is you know on the other places so yeah a lot of amazon products are the set exactly the same things but amazon charges a lot more so if you haven't already downloaded the app um if you use the code that's at the top of my screen um there you will get a discount um i can't remember how much it is now i think it's 30 percent off your first order but the prices are really cheap anyway um, and you get like a coupon bundle of i think it's either a hundred dollars or a hundred pounds depending on where you are um so yeah do that and save yourself some money because i didn't do that and i missed out on that so yeah i would recommend that uh, so yeah let's get into what we've got today so i've been seeing people buying these sleeves for their practice hands and i really wanted some um so yeah a little bit of a of a clue um as to what's going to come up in a future video i have ordered and i'm currently waiting for a brand new practice hand to arrive so i'm really excited um i can't wait it's on its way so i'm buying quite a few things for that so uh, yeah i'll go through them so this is one of those sleeves so let's just take it out and have a look okay so you do get two sleeves and obviously i only need one really um, so what I might do is put all the second ones um, in together and maybe do a giveaway. So you've got two sides to this. You've got this side, which is, um, it's a really nice sort of lace, like sort of net, isn't it? It's very, it's very delicate and that's on that side. So that's what it would look like when it's on. And then you've also got this side, which is different. And then that looks like that. So I wanted that because it's kind of see-through in a bit. I just like the way it looked. So next to these ones, and I wanted these because they are more like sort of woolen sleeves and I wanted sort of a different look. So I wanted these as well. So I'll show you what these look like. So these are shorter and they're obviously like the knitted ones. I really like the look of these. They're a bit more expensive than the other ones that i just shown you. Uh, but I think they are quite good quality they've got um like a thumb hole as well so i know i said that i bought these for the practice hand but you could use them yourself if you wanted to so let me just put this one on show you what it looks like so this is how it looks so i really like that because yeah when it's cold and in the uk it's cold quite a lot you know these would really help if you've got like a just sort of a t-shirt on or something that's not that thick, but you wanted, you know, your, your hands and your arms to be warm, and, but you didn't want to wear gloves. But I think that looks really good on my hands. So, yeah, and they fit perfectly because it's knitted. It'll obviously expand. So, yeah, it's not really tight like them. So I did get one last set, and that's these ones. These are, like, lacy ones. So, obviously, I got light colours. I got all, like, white ones this time. I did look at the dark ones, but I didn't think they looked as good. Okay, so it's funny because they remind me of stockings or tights. So you've got the smaller, smaller bit there at that end. And then I'm assuming your arm goes in here at this end. And there's no, there's no thumb hole on this one. But that's how that looks. Well, that's really nice, that one. So yeah, they just make you, you know, your practice hand look better in the photographs that you take and just gives you a bit of a different look. So next we've got some sort of boring things really. I've got some wipes, some nail wipes. So these are the ones that I get normally. Let me show you, they're just like those ones. And I will open this packet because I wanna keep that fresh. I'll show you these that I've already got. So they look like this. 
And these are really good for just when you want to sort of wipe your brush off and stuff like that. When you've got, say, a detailer brush and you just want to wipe it off. You can do it all over this surface, but you can't wipe a lot of times with these. If you were sort of wiping your nail and really sort of rubbing it like this, it's, it's going to start deteriorating and, and coming apart. So these are just exactly the same as these. They're just like a refill. So I will be filling those up. And then these ones I've not tried before, but I have seen other people using them. These are like the really, really thin ones. So I'm just going to open this up and we'll have a bit of a test. So they're definitely stiffer than those other ones. Let's just try and just get one. So they're quite thick. I was expecting them to be like really thin and, and a bit rubbish, but no, they're stiffer. Um, so yeah, I'll have to see what they're like. Okay, so that is sort of the boring stuff out of the way. I've got some more things for the practice hand now. So I also wanted to get some rings and I've never bought jewellery off Timu before, but I've seen other people get rings for the for themselves and their practice hands. Um, so there's a few different ones that I wanted. So I've got this one, which I will open. So I wanted to be able to wear them as well as put them on the practice hand and I wanted them all to be adjustable. So all the rings I bought are adjustable and this is like a moon and a moon and stars ring. I don't know if this will fit. Well, that fits on my middle finger like that. Just excuse this, I burnt my hand on the oven again and I did it there as well. I'm terrible. I put my hand in the oven to get things and I've got an oven glove on or I've got a tea towel, but I end up accidentally touching the, um, the, touching the racks inside like that because I'm an idiot. So that's that's really nice. I like that. And it's really sturdy as well. It doesn't feel like really cheap and nasty. It feels nice. So I've got another one. This is, you can't really see it in the packet. It's a butterfly one. So I'll take this out as well. Oh, wow. I love this. How gorgeous is that? How pretty is that? So you've got the crystal butterfly on one side and then you've got, oh, I didn't think that would have stones in, but it has. It's got tiny, tiny little like um, gems in it, like rhinestones in it. Oh, that is so pretty. And this is definitely more flimsy than the other one, but it's more delicate. Let's see if that'll fit on that one, on that one. Oh, wow, that's beautiful. Yeah, I really like that. And obviously just to adjust it, because it's a little bit big, you just sort of press it together. But I'm not going to do that because... I don't want to change it just yet. I love that. So this is the next one. And this is like um, a leaf pattern, this one. Let's get it out and have a look. So this is what that one looks like. So it's leaves, but it's got gems in it. It's got stones in it. And it's actually got the bigger leaves have got like bigger stones like this one. Oh, that moves a bit, that one. And then these leaves, the smaller ones, have got tiny, tiny stones in. And this looks like it's a bit, oh yeah, that's quite a bit bigger, that one. So I would have to adjust that one. But that's lovely, that. I wonder if it would fit on my thumb. Yeah, it'll fit on my thumb. Oh, I like that. Oh, that's so pretty. And then I got one more. And this has got a little rose on it. So if you can see, it's like iridescent, the rose. And I just thought it was really pretty. And then it's got a little, little gem on that side. This feels a bit smaller than the other one. So I'll have to go on this one. Oh, that's really cute. I like that. It's really dainty. Because I don't like really big in your face ones, but that's gorgeous, that. Yeah, I love that. And again, it's adjustable. So if it was a bit big, you just press it together. So obviously when my practice hand arrives, I will be showing you, I will be filming, unboxing it and everything for you so you can see, but I'm so excited for it. Something that I've saved up for, for a long time. So yeah, can't wait. Okay, so the next things that I've got are um, for stamping. So if you remember last time, on my last haul, I did get some stamping plates, but I got some more. 
Okay, so this is the first one. So this has got some rose images on it. I'm not taking the blue plastic off just yet. But yeah, that's that one. Um, I know I said that I was waiting for some stamping polishes. I actually bought some stamping gels from eBay because for some reason, when I ordered my stamping polishes, they have been stuck in this country. They've got here on the tracking and then they've been stuck here for a month, a whole month they've been here and nothing's happened on the tracking. So they've either got lost um, or they're just stuck somewhere for some reason. So I've had to go and yeah, buy some different, buy some gels instead. So I will be experimenting with those soon. So yeah, it's been a long time since I've done stamping, but I'm going to give it a go again. So this one's got all moons and stars on it. I really like the look of this one when I, when I saw it on the web, on the app. So yeah, I wanted that. So this is the next one and this has got some leopard print on it. And it's got like a leopard print butterfly. And then yeah, you've got like a zebra heart. I really like that. And a zebra there as well. And I like these ones because they'd be nice for like sort of down the middle of a nail. Okay, then I got this one. And what I'm really interested in doing is some layered stamping. And the, this is a layered plate, so you would have, um, you know, these butterflies here. So you would put this one down first, you'd pick your colour, and then you'd put that one on. And then you'd go over the top with this, because this is like the detail part. Yeah, and then this one, you'd put that one down first, and then put that over the top. And it's the same with all of them. Now, these ones, these leaf, one, leaf ones, I have actually got all these images on a different plate, which I will show you in a minute. Um, so it was, you know, I suppose it was a bit of a waste, but they're so cheap, it doesn't matter really. And the other plate that I got has got more on it that I wanted, but I still wanted this one because the other plate has got these on, but it's not got these butterflies on and I wanted those. So this last one is an XL plate, so it's really big. So, yeah, those were, you know, I told you about the, the leaves that are here. But, yeah, there's different ones on that aren't on the other plate. Like all these weren't on it. And I like these because you've got the negative. Um, because you've got these ones. And I really like these ones. But then, yeah, I liked all of the leaf ones. I, I do, I do like leaf designs, especially for stamping. So, yeah, I really wanted that that plate. This was the most expensive plate. I think for Timu, it was quite expensive. This one, but it is really big. It's like sort of got double the amount of images that one of these has. So I suppose, yeah, you would like pay double for it, wouldn't you? So. There are like different sizes and shapes, these stamping plates. So I did need something to put them in or at least some of them. So that brings me to my last item, which is this. And I can already see that it's probably a bit too small, but we will have a look. So obviously you can see it's silver, it's holographic. Um, and this brand, they do sell a lot on Timu. So um, some of the plates are probably from this brand. So, yeah, you've got all your little pockets there. I can't remember how many are in here. There's not that many, actually. So I don't know if these will fit in because these are very tall. Oh, yeah, they do. So that fits in there. And put that one on that side and then I was thinking these ones would fit in yep they do so that's perfect I know that XL one isn't going to fit in but this one with the back in let's see if that fits in so obviously you can put one in each side so yeah that's the perfect size for that brilliant so yeah obviously that is way too big but i'm not going to get very many of those so yeah i like that that's uh that's good and it feels good as well it's not a cheap nasty one you can get these like plastic ones 
um, and I really didn't want one of those. I wanted like this. I know it's not leather, but it's it's soft like that. It feels like that, and I like that it's hollow too. By the way, I know I haven't shown you these nails yet, but they will be on my channel soon. That's going to be a tutorial that is going to come up very soon. Okay, so that is everything from this haul. So if you liked any of this stuff, I will leave links in the description box so that you can buy the same thing. If there isn't the exact link, because some of these links expire quite quickly, um, then they usually the items are available from a different seller on Timu. So I'll put a different link on for you so that you can still get the same thing. Um, so yeah, I'll do a little video showing you the stamping plates and showing you me using them with the stamping gels um, and see how they get on because I do like the way that gels look rather than the polishes. So we'll see if I can master that. So do let me know in the comments if you've used any of these products, if you've used the wipes or the stamping plates and what you think of them um, because it does help other people when they're deciding what to buy. It helps me if I see a video of someone using some stuff and they say, oh, that's rubbish, or they say, that's really good. It does help you to, to choose what to buy. Um, yeah, and you want to buy the stuff that actually works. So, yeah, I'd love to hear from you and hear what your experiences are as well. So, yeah, if you did like this video, please give it a like. If you're not already a subscriber, please consider subscribing. And I will see you in the next video. So, thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.